everyone, you might be trying to figure out how you can screen record on your iPad. Especially if you bought the M2 iPad Pro, this is exactly how you do it. And it is a very, very basic process. So what you want to do here is, like I said, very basic. You want to go ahead and make your way over to your settings application. And what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go and scroll down until we get into our control center panel. So right here, we'll see control center. We want to go ahead and tap on that and we'll come into this panel on the right hand side. Now what we want to do is we basically want to scroll down until we find that little screen recording toggle down here. Now I've already added it, but in this case I'll just go and delete it. So yours is going to look something like this. We're going to want to go and click here, scroll down, click on screen recording, which is right there. So click that plus button next to it, and then you'll see what I had a second ago, which is that screen recording toggle. So now what you want to do is you want to get into the panel you want to screen record. For this test, I'm just going to be screen recording the panel. But what you can do is now swipe down from the top right corner and you will see this new little circle button right here. Now, I would recommend holding down on that circle button and seeing if you want to turn on the microphone or not. It can record you talking as well as the, what's on the screen. So you might want to mute what's on the screen if you don't want to just, you know, see what, or you can just keep the microphone off and just record the screen by itself. And when you're ready, it'll count down from three. And when it counts down and you see that red little button right there, you are pretty much good to go. Now on the top right, it'll also go ahead and show you that and that means you're screen recording. So now whatever you're doing, it's going to screen record. Now, whenever you're done, you can go and click on the little red button here, click stop. And now the screen recording has stopped. You'll get that little banner. You can either click on that banner or you can go and open up the photos app, go into recents, and you'll basically be able to see that screen recording that you made right there. So that is basically how you do it. It's a very, very basic process. And that's basically how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.